Hello there. To open a link in a WebGL build, you will need a plugin. You can download this plugin from the description below. If you can't download the plugin from the link, go ahead and pause the video to type it manually in a text editor like Notepad or Notepad++. Make sure the file extension is JSLIB. Go to Unity and create a new folder called Plugins in the Assets folder. Open this folder and drag the plugin into it. Now create a new script called Open Links and drag it to any game object you want. I will drop it in the main camera. Open the script and the first thing you need to do is to import system.runtime.interopservices. Now type down this attribute. DLL import open brackets with double quotes. Type underscore underscore internal with capital I. Again, there are two underscores, not one. Under this attribute, type private static extern void open tab with a string parameter called URL. This step can be done only after adding the plugin in the plugins folder. If you are getting errors, then make sure you have added the plugin correctly to the plugins folder. If you typed it manually, then you probably typed something wrong. Now create a public static void function called openURL with a string parameter called URL. In this function, call the open tab that we just typed below with the URL as an argument. To make sure you run this code only in a WebGL build, type if not Unity Editor and Unity WebGL all uppercase and close it with end if. Now let's go back to Unity and add the script to the button that I have created before recording. Since my script is in the main camera, I will select it and then select open links open URL. A text box will appear. Here you can type the URL you want to open. I will type down my website. Another way to open a link is from the inside of the script without having to type the URL in the inspector. Let me show you how. I will create a new script called another script and drag it to the main camera. Open the script and create a new function. This function can be anything. Inside this function, you can call open URL from open links. You will have to type the URL in here. If you are getting errors here, make sure that the open URL function is static. I will quickly link the function to the second button. Now let's build and run to test our buttons.